So, what's going on guys, Kade is here, welcome back to a brand new video, and today I'll show you Shroud's new Warzone sensitivity, keybinds, settings, what loadouts he's using, all the new guns with attachments, his new peripherals, and much more. So, if this sounds interesting to you, then sit back, relax, and let's get right into it. Then, going over to his mouse sensitivity, for DPI he's using 450. And the mouse sensitivity in game is 7.50. Then the rest of the stuff like vertical, ground, air vehicle and tablet sensitive multiplier, all of them is on default which is 1.00. Aim down sights, mouse sensitivity is relative, add sensitivity, multiplier for low zoom and high zoom, both of them are default as well, add sensitivity, transition timing is gradual and monitor distance coefficients is 1.33. Invert mouse lock is disabled mouse scope acceleration is zero mouse filtering is zero and mouse smoothing is disabled then going over to movement the slide behavior is tap which is locked crouch behavior is hold prone behavior is toggle automatic airborne mantle is disabled sprint slash tactical sprint behavior is on toggle automatic sprint is on automatic tactical sprint and parachute auto deploy is enabled then for his movement keybinds for normal blocking he's using the w s a and d movement use is f jump slash stand slash mantle is on space crouch slash slide is on left control crouch is on left control prone is on z and change stand slide is on c sprinting and tactical sprinting and steady aiming is on left shift gesture slash sprays are on t then moving down to weapon slash equipment for depleted ammo weapon switch is enabled switch weapon minimum delay is on zero weapon switch wrap slash around is on enabled weapon mount activation is on toggle weapon mount keybind weapon mount movement exit is enabled weapon mount exit delay is 100 and aim sight behavior is on hold change zoom slash toggle hybrid behavior is on sprint slash tactical sprint slash steady aim equipment behavior is on hold then for his weapon key bindings for reload he has r for next weapon one or scroll wheel to the mouse weapon mount is e alternate fire is b melee slash finishing move is on caps lock use little equipment is on x and use tactical equipment is on q night vision goggles is on n mission ability is on four and change to loadout one is on number one then moving over to general for field of view he's using 100 and adds field of view is on independent brightness is on 50 horizontal heads display hud and vertical heads up display hud both of them are on default which is 100 minimap shape is on square and minimap rotation is enabled and last but not the least in the section he likes to enable fps showing in his top left corner then moving over to graphics for display mode he's using full screen display monitor is his gaming one display adapter is his main video card and screen refresh rate is on 240 render resolution is the default which is 1920 by 1080 then aspect ratio is automatic sync every frame is disabled and custom frame limit is on custom the gameplay custom frame limit is on maximum which is 300 menu custom frame limit is on 60 and out of focus custom frame limit is on maximum as well which is 300 then moving over to details and textures the texture resolution is on high texture filter anisotropic is on high particle quality is on high bullet impact slash phrase are enabled and tessellation is on near then looking at shadows and lightning shadow map resolution is on normal and both catch spot shadows and catch sun shadows are disabled particle quality is on high direct x retracing is disabled and ambient enclosion is disabled as well screen space reflection aka ssr is on high and then looking at last thing but not the least which is the post processing effect anti-aliasing is on sma p2x depth of field is disabled filmic strength is on one world motion blur is disabled as well as weapon motion blur is disabled as well and fill grain is on zero and last but not the least taking a closer look at shroud's favorite loadout for his primary weapon he's using the m4a1 secondary weapon is just a random pistol which he usually switches to a rocket launcher or a different gun that he got already in warzone for his perks he has the cold blooded ghost and amp for lethal equipment he has the frag grenade and for tactical equipment he has smoke grenade then looking at his primary weapon which is the m4a1 for muzzle he's using the monolithic suppressor barrel is the fss 14.5 tac light for optic he has the operator reflex scythe then he has no stock and ammunition is 60 round magazine and then looking at his main peripherals for his gaming monitor he's using the acer predator xp 252q 
For his gaming mouse, he's using the Logitech G Pro Wireless Ghost. His mousepad is the Logitech G640. For his keyboard, he's using the Logitech G Pro X mechanical keyboard. And the headset is the Logitech G Pro X. And with that said, that's about it. If in any case you have any questions or future video improvements or maybe other streamers and YouTubers that you'd like me to make a video about, let me know all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click that like and subscribe to keep up to date with every video, top 10 list or that I make which is every single day. And last but none the least enable that notification bell so you would get notified when a new video is up and running appreciate it for watching guys hope you enjoyed it my name is kate you have an amazing day and i'll see you tomorrow take it easy peace Yo, I ain't here for the money.